Dermatophytes are types of fungi that cause common skin, hair, and nail infections. Infections caused by these fungi are also known by the names tinea and ringworm. It is important to emphasize that ringworm is not caused by a worm, but rather a type of fungus called a dermatophyte. Trichophyton rubrum and Trichophyton tonsorians are two common dermatophytes. These two species are usually transmitted from person to person. Another common dermatophyte is Microsporum canis, which is transmitted from animals such as cats and dogs to people. Dermatophytes like to live on moist areas of the skin, such as places where their skin folds. They can also contaminate items in the environment, such as clothing, towels, and bedding. Dermatophyte infections are very common. They can affect anyone, including people who are otherwise healthy. Dermatophyte infections may be more common among people with suppressed immune systems, people who use communal baths, and people who are involved in contact sports, such as wrestling. Outbreaks of these infections can occur in schools, households, and institutional settings. The dermatophyte infection that affects the scalp and hair is known as tinea capitis. It is especially common among school-aged children. For reasons that are not well understood, tinea capitis does not usually occur after puberty. Other kinds of dermatophyte infections tend to be more common in adolescents and adults. Dermatophyte infections can affect the skin on almost any area of the body, such as the scalp, legs, arms, feet, groin, and nails. These infections are usually itchy. Redness, scaling, or fissuring of the skin, or a ring with irregular borders in a cleared central area may occur. If the infection involves a scalp, an area of hair loss may result. More aggressive infections may lead to an abscess or cellulitis. Areas infected by dermatophytes may become secondarily infected by bacteria. Symptoms typically appear between 4 and 14 days following exposure to the fungi. These are just a few things to know about dermatophytes. To learn more about infectious environmental disease testing services and prevention measures or other indoor environmental concerns, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.